Good lord. Oh, oh crap. Oof. Oof. <laughs> hey, Wilson. I'm glad you showed up, man. Dude, I got a new Bluetooth speaker, man. This one is a doozy. This is hands down the biggest Bluetooth speaker I've ever had on this channel, I think. Kind of, sort of. The other one was a DJ system, but this right here is the iFi Aurora. And this thing has got, let me look here. What does it have? It's got high res streaming over Wi-Fi, Aptex, 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 Aptex HD, AirPlay, DLNA, high res sound space, automatic room tailoring, true bass and pure emotion. Let's do it. Okay, I don't want to break this. Oh my God. Okay, you're looking at the back of it, I think. Man, it's got some weight to it, man. <laughs> it's got some weight to it. Whoo, this is it, man. Come on, let me spin it around. Dude. <laughs> okay. Oh man, it's got some weight. All right, get in there. Look at that thing. Can you see that, man? Oh man, that's classy. This looks like something Elon Musk would have in his little, you know, media room or something, man, powering up his TV or just for some smooth sounds. So Elon, get at me, man. I got a Bluetooth, you might, a Bluetooth speaker you might want to check out. Hey, if anybody knows Elon Musk's number, go ahead and send me his contact. All right, man, let's get this thing hooked up and we'll see everything it does. Oh yeah. Mm-hmm. Oh man, that is seductive. Let me get this thing powered on so we can talk about it. All right, we got it. Oh, it's warming up. Cool. So it's got a digital readout right there, man. That is so clean looking. All right, look in here, man. You got this tube amp. This thing has a built-in tube amp. It's cool that they let you actually see it. And then right here, we got the brightness. And then we have the art icon, which is automatic room tailoring. That's what that means. Then we have the true base symbol. Uh, these are all uh, touch capacitive buttons, by the way. So we got the true base symbol and I love the way iFi implements their true base. It truly is like true base. Then we got the mute Bluetooth functionality. Then we have this Wi-Fi symbol here because this can connect via Wi-Fi to uh, cast out your Apple uh, AirPlay as well as uh, cast out your music or cast, I guess, bring in your music from your phone. And that way you can play it over Wi-Fi versus Bluetooth. Then you have an optical input. Uh, then this is going to be your coaxial, and this is uh, your 3.5 auxiliary port right here. And all that you have to do is just touch these buttons. So if we touch the auxiliary, I think I just touched it by accident. Then you got the, uh, the coaxial right there, then your, your uh, optical, so that's pretty slick. And then your, there's your power button, which I won't touch, but then we can slide this volume right here. You see that, man? <laughs> that is slick. Man, that's some Elon Musk stuff right there, dude. Look at that, it's, it's doing it right there too. That's clean, man. So right here we have T-Base, which is True Base, and it says one. So I wonder if I hit it again, will it go to two? Yeah, True Base two and True Base three. So you got three different levels of True Base, and right now we have it on Art, which is the optical, I'm sorry, not optical, but automatic room tailoring. But if we hold this button, for two seconds, we'll go into audio file mode, which only gives you the selection of, once you start hitting that same button again, it gives you that, that space, it's called a sound space. So that's a different mode and it'll do the sound a little bit different, but it disengages the, um, the, the sonar. Is it, I'm guessing there's a little sonar things back there. I'll have to show you those in a second, man. It's got these little, it's got these little things on the back that kind of detect the room. And that's super cool that it has that built-in technology. But this is the front grill, man. It's all vented and then you have these drivers back here. So let's just take a deeper dive into the back of this thing before we get into the drivers and all the goodies. So as I prop this thing up on a roll of paper towels, cause I have nothing else. <laughs> let's just take a look at some stuff that's on the back. Right here, you got your RCA jacks right there. Here's your 3.5 millimeter input, your coaxial input optical input, digital input, and you can also plug that right into your Wi-Fi router if you want to. Uh, and then you've got a, um, a USB input right there, a micro SD card input, and then there's your DC in, which I don't know what that would be for because it actually does come with a power plug that goes right here. 
And that is gonna be it. But then you got all your labels for all of your stuff that this thing supports right here. Your high res and your Wi-Fi and the AirPlay DLNA, all that good stuff right there. And then if you feast your eyes right here at these two little sonar eyeballs, I guess that's kind of an oxymoron, but we're gonna use it today. These little things shoot out little rays or whatever they do to detect or help detect where this speaker is in relationship to the room that it's in. It also has two on the opposite side. They're back here in these little housings and we'll go over to that side in just a moment. But yeah, man, this is all that there is to it. It does have this metal frame right here. Let me turn this around. This thing got some serious weight to it. I wanna show you, oh my goodness. <sighs> okay, so it does have this metal frame around it that supports it and holds it up. It adds to the aesthetic, man. It's got a beautiful aesthetic and I love it. But if you want to showcase it, you can just take that off like that. And then it has a, it has them on the bottom. This one actually just fell off, but we have one right here as well. Just in case you got some kids or maybe a pet or something that's going to scratch themselves on this. Or even if you're clumsy, you don't want to impale yourself with this thing. You can just put this little cover on there. That's just a nice little added touch <laughs> that they've given you. These plus an extra set, just in case you want to protect the points of this thing. Now, as I promised earlier, here are two more of those little sonar sen sensors. And then there's two more on the opposite side right there. So you got a total of six of them casting out their little waves, trying to detect where this speaker is in the relationship to your room, giving you the best sound it can possibly give you. Now, an enclosure of this size definitely has room for a bunch of speakers and they give you a bunch. We're gonna start out with the small ones, man. We got two one and an eighth inch uh, cone tweeters right here. And then we have four, that's right. I said four, four and a half inch cone drivers. One, two, three, four, two on the sides. And then on the bottom, oh, there we go. You got two, that's right, two four by eight passive radiators. I'm getting a workout just doing this video, man. I'm starting to sweat. <laughs> but yeah, man, that's a lot of drivers. You got these two cone tweeters right here. Then you got the four cone drivers, two base radiators. Yeah, this thing is gonna jam for show. <laughs> Oh man, okay, okay. Well, look, this is the iFi Aurora. It's a badass Bluetooth speaker, man. It's got a bunch of technology built in and I'm really no expert in this kind of stuff. This stuff is way beyond my league, but it still got me in here jamming and sweating. I do know this though. I'm no expert, but I do know this. If you got Elon Musk type of money, you can get your jam on like Elon Musk. <laughs> <laughs> This Elon Musk jam, I can't imagine that guy jamming. <laughs> but if he did, he would have one of these in his house. <laughs> hey man, I gotta get out of here, but until we meet again, y'all make sure y'all keep being good to each other and I'll see you when I see you. Whoa, 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 let me get this straight. You sat through this whole video, the whole thing, and never once decided to hit the subscribe button or the like button, man, it be the ones closest to you. I'll see how you are. Is this not why you are here?